what led up to this when the when the judge um, let him out on ten thousand dollars bail? Um, what was the argument to support that? Because it just seems so crazy, you know, for people who are just kind of casually observing it, it, this. Because it, it seems like it's an attempted murder. Case. Right. Right. And, uh, you know, let, let, let me be clear on this. We, uh, given uh, what happened, uh, we have charged the defendant in this case with the most serious charges that are available on these facts. Uh, those felony charges carry a sentence of up to life in prison, uh, which is the most serious penalty that we have uh, in Michigan. Now, as to the uh, initial bond decision by the magistrate, you know, I'm not going to purport to speak for any other uh, actor in the legal system, except to say uh, that, you know, our recommendation initially was for a bond that was 10 times higher, uh, was for additional uh, restrictions to be put into place. Uh, and we made uh, use of our legal avenues uh, when we disagree with a judge's decision. Uh, we filed an emergency motion as soon as we got that decision with the court, which I argued uh, today. And thankfully, the bond was modified and the defendant is in custody as we speak. How did you turn that around uh, in court today? What argument did you make uh, that won the day? Uh, well, well, you know, uh, I just emphasize what the facts of this case show. Uh, this is a man who shot out of his window at a group of children playing on the sidewalk uh, in front of his house. It hit a six-year-old child. Uh, you know, uh, we are really, really thankful, and this is by far the most important thing, that that little boy uh, is not more seriously hurt. He's doing okay, although, you know, look, the trauma is going to, of course, stick with him for his entire life. But a couple of inches to the left or to the right, he could have been killed. Uh, and so, uh, you know, I just emphasized that and emphasized the public safety risk and we're, and, and we're grateful uh, that the court saw fit first to act quickly on this and to schedule uh, our emergency hearing uh, on an expedited basis and then ultimately uh, to grant our motion and to have the defendant uh, remanded into custody.